Lantech R&D presents the summary results of a project comparing four load wrapping materials, two paper and two film, for their commercial and environmental impact. The first, Hexel Stretch, is shown wrapping the selected midweight carton load to seven pounds of containment force. passing the acceleration test to 0.5 G's. Passing the shaker table at 150 cycles per minute for two minutes. The material is removed. And weighed. The second, Mondi Advantage, is shown wrapping the selected midweight carton load with six revolutions of paper at 40 pounds of tension. And passing the acceleration test to 0.5 G's. Passing the shaker table at 150 cycles per minute for two minutes. Material is removed and weighed. The third stretch film with 30% PCR is shown in the Lantec Film Lab being tested for optimum machine settings to achieve the required containment force at the lowest weight without film breaks. Wrapping the selected load to seven pounds of containment force. And passing the acceleration test to 0.5 Gs. Passing the shaker table test at 150 cycles per minute for two minutes. The material is removed and weighed. The fourth 60 gauge stretch film with 100% virgin resin shown in the Lantec Film Lab being tested for optimum machine settings to achieve the required containment force at the lowest weight without film breaks. Then wrapping the selected load to seven pounds of containment force. Passing the acceleration test to 0.5 G's. Passing the shaker table at 150 cycles per minute for two minutes The material removed and weighed. The data is summarized for each material by comparing cost per load, weight per load, and carbon footprint, clearly indicating 100% virgin film has the lowest cost, weight, and carbon footprint. This is a close-up of film leaving the pre-stretch, illustrating the root cause of the dramatic negative impact on stretch film performance when PCR content is added. Four conclusions focus on the implications of this study. First, the best choice for lowering impact on the environment is 100% virgin stretch film with no PCR. The second, adding PCR to stretch film actually increases the negative impact on the environment. 
And the third, stretch film should be recycled, but only into downcycle products such as hand wrap or shrink film where the PCR can be tolerated. And fourth, improvements in wrapper technology, film performance, and improved maintenance could contribute up to a 50% source reduction. For more information on this white paper, please visit us at Lantech.com. <laughs>